Okay, we're back at 741 to chat with preventive cardiology expert, Dr. Matthew J. Budoff. We, we can hear him now, so let's dig into all of the goodness of garlic. Thanks for being here with us. I know you've done a lot of research on garlic and the heart. So what is it about garlic that really caught your attention? Yeah, you know, uh, it's been around for thousands of years. Uh, it was a performance enhancer in the ancient Olympics. And, and uh, it, it's been shown to lower cholesterol and reduce blood pressure. So I studied it in the context of whether it would be good to help prevent heart attacks and, and reverse plaque in the arteries. Yeah, and so what are the heart health benefits that you found from you know this vegetable that oftentimes is overlooked? Yeah, so it, it reverses plaque in the arteries. We studied an agent called kyolic, which is a odorless garlic. Uh, so for those of you who don't like the smell, uh, there are formulations that are aged and a little, little less pungent, um, but uh, it lowered plaque in the arteries and really started to reverse some of the, the buildup of plaque that was occurring over the years. Interesting. And now I know I, I like a bunch of garlic in whatever mm -hmm. recipe I'm, I'm cooking with, but I know that's not up everybody's alley. And I, I usually think of it kind of being combined with a lot of butter or oh, cheese yeah. or pasta. Uh, but you're saying there's, there's a healthier way that we can get this too, kind of a garlic extract? Yeah, so it's aged. Kind of think of like what grapes go to become wine. This is aged. It gets rid of some of the toxins, a little easier on the stomach and certainly easier on your spouse. Um, <laughs> uh, <laughs> So it, it helps a lot uh, for, for research also. I can't smell my patient and say, oh, you're in the garlic arm or you're in the placebo arm. So it was a good one for, for research as well. But it worked really well. And uh, we've done five studies. And uh, each one of them showed that it slows or reverses plaque in the arteries. So I'm very enthusiastic that this is going to be a good therapy for people. Uh, and it's been shown to be a stress reducer, which might be helpful in these uh, unusual times. Yeah, definitely. that's all good to know. And, and yeah, I definitely, like my breath is, it's intense when yeah. I have garlic. Like Same I think here. some people it's worse than others. <laughs> uh, are there any side effects from eating garlic alone or, or taking it as a supplement? No, just uh, usually it's people's stomach. Uh, uh, some people don't tolerate uh, the fresh garlic or raw garlic. It's a little, a little pungent and, and that makes it a little toxic for the stomach as well but uh, very well tolerated and uh, very good for you. It's part of the Mediterranean diet, which is the diet that's been shown to, to make you live the longest of the diets that we've studied. So, uh, you know, something has been around forever, but uh, really good for you in, in these times. Huh. And I like the idea, like you said, that it's a, a stress reducer too. I mm -hmm. think that's really important right now. I I'm curious, out of all of the research you've conducted on garlic, we've, we've learned that it can help with cholesterol and plaque, but what, what excites you the most about it? Well, you know, it, it actually it was initially used as an anti-infective agent for bacteria and viruses. And obviously, in these times, it's nice to have something that might also protect us a little bit from infection. So, uh, you know, we, we haven't studied it specifically with COVID, but it does. It has been shown to, to help fight bacteria and viruses. So I, I think it's something that's worth uh, supplementing your, your diet with in, in these times. Mm -hmm. And it wards off vampires, too. So, that, you know, too. there is that. <laughs> Very helpful. <laughs> All right. Well, Dr. Buddha, thank you so much for joining us. We appreciate your time this morning. Have a good one. You too. Be well.